People ask you, what school do you go to? When you graduated 10 years ago. When you're out with your children, people think you're the babysitter. You get ID'd at the movie theater. This video is not sponsored. I'm gonna share my tips for how to look your age when you have a baby face. With all my baby faces, please stand up, please stand up, please stand up. And the things that can make you look even younger than you already do. I personally avoid hoodies and sweatshirts and sweatpants because they make me look like I'm in high school because those are the kind of things that, that I would wear if I were in high school. Some people can wear these things, no problem, it has no effect on their age. When you have a baby face, even like the tiniest little details can make such a difference. If you are going to wear hoodies and sweatshirts, try mixing your sweats with something a little bit more sophisticated like a trench coat. This is very fashionable right now. People are wearing their sweatsuits, but then they put a trench coat on top and they instantly go from looking like a high school student to looking like a woman. I personally am a huge fan of child-inspired fashion. One of my favorite t-shirts is a flower graphic t-shirt that is probably currently being worn by an 11 year old as we speak. I love overalls, but I am aware that when I wear overalls, I look like a child. If you really, truly have your heart set on a one piece, a jumpsuit is a great alternative. It's still comfortable. It's still a one piece. It's still easy. Bringing in the waist just gives it a more feminine silhouette that looks more mature, that looks more sophisticated, looks like you did a little extra touch. What are you using to put your things in? Do you use a purse? Do you use a backpack? Do you use a suitcase? I have noticed that when I personally wear backpacks, I'm more commonly mistaken for a high school student than if I have a purse. And not all backpacks are created equal. Some backpacks are very mature and some backpacks look like high school backpacks. I'll let you be the judge of that, but just something to consider. Our accessories can make us look younger or older or closer to our age. Hairstyles. How do you wear your hair? There are certain hairstyles that can make us look very young. One of them being the two bun. Hold on. My daughter is calling for me. Where was I? There are some hairstyles that can make us look a lot younger than we are. One of them being, and one that I actually really do love because I think it's super cute, it's the buns, the two buns at the top of your head. In fact, any kind of pigtail instantly makes me look like I'm in elementary school. The alternative to the adorable space buns is a nice low bun in the back with a couple curls hanging out the front and it still achieves the same goal of getting all of your hair out of your face. A little eyewear can go a long way in making you look more sophisticated, more mature. I like to wear my glasses when I'm attending events where I want to be perceived as older. When I wore these glasses, somebody asked me if I was a realtor and usually somebody would ask me what school I go to. Yeah? Hold on. Look for inspiration on Pinterest, on YouTube, on Instagram. I tend to look at people who are in their 30s. If you don't know what to wear, if you're looking for some inspiration, there is plenty of it on the internet. Quality over quantity. When I was younger, especially in high school, I tended to opt for quantity over quality. As in, I bought a ton of stuff, but it would all fall apart within a year because it was so poorly made. And now, I buy fewer things, but they are made to be higher quality, therefore they last longer. And higher quality clothes just look more expensive, and things that look more expensive tend to make us look more mature. 100% cotton sweaters over 100% acrylic sweaters. Acrylic sweaters are not only going to fall apart, but they're just not as comfortable as cotton sweaters. So read the labels and invest in pieces that are going to last longer. Tailor your clothes if you need to. There's something about clothes that fit you well, that fit you properly, that just make you look so much more sophisticated and so much more like your age. When you're younger, at least speaking from personal experience, I would buy things even when they didn't fit, even when they weren't my size, just because I like them. When possible, if something doesn't fit you right, tailor it, or if you don't wanna tailor it and maybe you don't like it that much, then just donate it. Are you shining bright like a diamond? I'm talking about your makeup. Are you wearing sparkly makeup on your eyes? There's something about sparkles that just make 
I look so young. Of course, makeup is a personal expression of yourself. Wear whatever you want. But whenever I wear anything sparkly, it just makes me look so young because it is something that I probably would have done when I was in high school. So anything that I would have done in high school, when I do it now, it just teleports me back into that time. But if you want to shine bright, then go on and shine bright like a diamond. Confidence, baby. It's all about the confidence. This is actually the most important ingredient in people perceiving you as your age. Not all teenagers and not all adolescents do this, but very often, at least when I was an adolescent, I kind of tended to carry myself like this. So I'm just mindful of like sitting up straight, carrying myself with confidence, not biting my nails, not doing anything that would make me look younger. All of these things, all of these little details add up. Confidence is the key. I think, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish this video. Oh, oh, it was the last tip. It was the last tip. I gotta go BRB guys. Time is running short. I probably only have a few minutes left to finish this video. Remember, we have a lot more power than we think. Just because you have a baby face does not mean that you forever have to be perceived as being younger than you are. But at the end of the day, if you have a baby face and you want to wear sweatsuits, you want to wear sparkly makeup, you want to wear your in space buns, do it. I say do it. I definitely break the rules all the time because I'm a rebel. <laughs> Let me in the comments below. Do you have a baby face? When was the last time somebody thought you were younger than you were? I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye. Can we also have a little celebration for the fact that we finished this video? I thought I was gonna have to refilm this tomorrow, but we finished it, guys. <laughs> Gotta celebrate victories. <laughs>